Hey YouTube, I got you and today I'm going to show you how to make a carbon fiber pattern in Photoshop. Okay, well, let's just call it carbon. Then you need to make sure the pixels is set to 4 pixels by 4 pixels and the background content is set to transparent. That's vital that bit. Right here, okay. When you've done that, you should see the tiny square in the middle. Right? Just press Ctrl plus until it says 800%. The percent's down here, if you don't know. And go to your pencil tool. And it's like to the one pixel brush. Which is that there. Right, then go across to the, to the description. Which should have these eight sets of six digits in. Yeah, the eight sets of six digits in. Copy and paste the first number. Into the foreground. And to paste into there. They need to create a two by one rectangle in the top left corner, just like I've done there. Then go back across to the description, get the second number, across to the foreground, paste, come on, paste, yeah, paste into there, and do your rectangle then, again. Copy and paste the third one. Copy it into there, don't paste. Yes, do paste. Paste it into there. Then do that. Why have I made that bigger? I don't know. Then go back to the description. I know you've probably twigged what to do by now, but just keep watching just in case you mess up the next bit. Then go back to here. Copy and paste it in. And why won't this copy and paste? I seem to have trouble with that number. Don't know why. But anyway. Do the next one on the bottom. And then for the fifth one. You do it in the top right hand corner. Instead of the bottom left. Or the bottom right. Shall I say. Let's copy that up there. And just follow the list down. Do the next three colours, so you probably know what to do by now. By the time you've done it, should come looking out like this. Right? So if you dumbasses who don't know how to use, well, the pattern, use it like this. You can either use it in the pattern stamp tool, which you can use it as a stamp, I suppose, or a brush, whatever you want to call it. Or you can use the fill tool, which you'll need to set to pattern because by default it's set to what you call it, it's, um, foreground. Yeah. Before you finish, make sure wrong one, wrong one again. Make sure you go to edit, define pattern, and then call it carbon, carbon fiber. Right. I'm just gonna press cancel because I've already got it. All right. Thanks for watching YouTube. Comment, rate, subscribe. See ya.